Hey everyone, this is Ragnamune. Welcome back to Let's Play Subterranea. In the last episode, we got through levels 7 and 8. I only died once, thank god. And now we're in the last level. Watch your friggin' self out here. Kill them first. Now you're gonna find something a little breaking for these water sections. If I can ever manage to get myself to it. Uh, right here. This is a nuclear crystal. This gives you unlimited fuel, and no matter where you're at. So now we don't have to worry about fuel. So let me tell you, there's a lot of stuff to do in here. Look at that. Extra life in the last level. How generous is that? I love this music. Okay, nothing down here. There's another laser color. I'm gonna pick up the red one now. Because I want the red one for the final boss. Yes, there's a boss. Oh, man. Again, I'm just... It's amazing. Now well, that's done. Give me the red laser. Me want. Yes, red. It's only because now I've got so much of a range instead of. I gotta be so dang close. Like I needed fuel. Let me get down there and get the shield. Oh, that's right. No, not missiles. Nuclear reactor. Uh, no. Anti-pressure. Did you hear that? I love that. It's a good sound. Like this is a, this is one of my favorite games on the Genesis. Just use the missiles now. Just look how powerful the red laser is compared to the other ones. Like the blue one's nice, but I've wanted the red one. You know, the red one! Did I really just quote that movie? Ugh, I am a, I am a nutcase, ladies and gentlemen. And sometimes, the world needs a few nuts, right? So if there's gonna be a nut in this world, let it be me. Now that I have the key, kill that, kill that stupid shell. Yeah, so oyster shells are rising up to take over the world. Stick down! No, go up. Uh, this is why they gave you that infinite fuel, because... My god. This would rage quit. This would make gamers rage quit so much. Oh, and I recently watched a CGR undertow review of this game, and this is what made me want to LP it. They said you need patience to play this game. I'm wondering, what would happen if I would post this as a video response or something? Ah, listen to me. I am just asking for trouble. Am I not a big nerd or what? Hey, look, it's crab men. Kill the crabs. Alien crabs are not welcome here. Ah, no! Ah! Away from the anti-pressure. How did I get past that? Look, I thought there was something underneath that made... That told me I was supposed to go past it. Oh, I was supposed to go underneath as it was. So how did I get past that? Ah! I'm almost dead. Ugh. Come on. Pull through. Pull through!
I think I gotta go up. Ah! Not able to go up. Not able to go up. I gotta go this way then. Ah, okay. Good. That opened the gate. I have a way of doing it though with all that anti pressure. All the pressure. Must get through gate without dying. Man, a machine has reached its limit, my friends. Kill him, okay. Ah! Close one, he almost got me there. Can I find some shield replenisher down here? Holy crap! Man! That was a shot in the dark, guess, because I saw a branching path. Oh, that is so good. Oh man, that was close. Okay, the game has been saved. We're now in a place called Spin's Cave. And the start's been relocated. Try not to hit too many things since we're at the final boss of the game. This is Spin, ladies and gentlemen. The final boss of the game. Back in my childhood, I actually called him Gyarados. <laughs> I was an idiot. Ow! Okay, I killed the bone tail, which I needed to do. Now I just gotta kick his ass and there. He's dead. Giant crab! Look at me, I'm just up here minding my own business. Ow! He's charging up for another run. Ow! And you're gone. Look at that, I won. <laughs> oh, jeez. Just look at the graphics right now. Look at what's going on. A nice planet. I think the ship's a little too big compared to the planet size, but that's just me. Gigantic ship! Congratulations! During the campaign to free the subterranean mining site, you made yourself worthy to carry the most distinguished title within our system of ranks. You have proven to be a brave and cool-minded warrior, and if a similar situation should arise, we hope you will face the challenge. And yes, I do agree, I'm a pansy for playing this on easy mode. But now it's time for me to just give you my thoughts about this game. <laughs> the moment I saw code, I thought that meant, oh my god, secret code! Anyways. I'm gonna turn this down a little bit. Look like, like I should have done in the first place. Uh, yeah, like I said, this game was part of my childhood. And I enjoyed this game. I played it every couple of days. To see if I could just keep beating it over and over again. And trying to raise my score or something, or probably to see how fast I could beat it. And my god, I I'm just happy I played this game again, because it just, it took me back. There's some games who can define who you are, and that you can say, hey, I'm proud I played the, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm proud I played this game. 
And I, for one, am proud that I had the pleasure of playing this game. <sighs> Look at all them testers. They're lucky they get money for playing video games. But anyways, yeah. In this game, it is pretty damn hard. Since you gotta be ready and willing to just deal with its gravity. All you need to do is master its gravity movements and then it's not that hard. Heck, you saw me failing and look how kind of bad I did on easy mode. Sure, I escaped with like 3-4 lives that were never used, but just come on. You saw how bad I was failing? But anyways, for a 1993 Genesis game, this was just, it was a gem. And I loved it so much. So guys, I'm just going to tell you now, thank you so much for watching this, and I gotta thank myself for getting off my lazy ass and playing this game, because I enjoyed it. High score! Is there a way to backspace? Good. Time to enter our name and glory. Ragnamund? That's not how it's supposed to be! No! <laughs> ah! Whether it's before I play the game or after I play the game, I fail! <laughs> uh, you guys go away now. But seriously, thanks, thanks so much for watching. <laughs> I'll see you guys later. Damn it! It is not Ragnamund! <laughs> I was surprised there'd be enough for me to enter the full name, anyways. Uh, God, I love this game. <sighs>